shooting has been growing exponentially in India from the first half, the very first decade of 21st century. But still, India didn't have a handful number of pistol shooters, mainly in 25-meter women's category, to bring home international medals until the present golden generation of Indian shooting emerged. Among very few names, the one who carried Indian hopes in this particular event throughout more than a decade now, Rahi Sarnavat. The current world number two will be heading to Tokyo with a lot of prospect for a podium finish. Now 30-year-old Rahi was born in Kolhapur, Maharashtra. She first came across to the sport in school as it was a part of the NCC training. Due to lack of infrastructure in her hometown, she had to come to Mumbai for her training. ISSF official website says that the right-handed, right-eyed girl started practicing from 2007 and started competing 2008 onwards. Rahi, who says, shooting is my life, preferred 10 meter air pistol over 25 meter in her initial days. But interesting enough, after she had to fight in 25 meter pistol category in 2008 Youth Commonwealth Games in Pune because of the one contestant per category selection policy of national team where she went on to win gold, she went on to continue in the 25 meter range and this set up her path to the top tier of international standards. After that breakthrough performance in the youth level of the Commonwealth Games in 2008, it was the time for the senior level. 2010 CWG in Delhi and she came away with two medals. One golden pairs with Anisha Said and another silver in individual 25-meter pistol. She followed it up with a bronze in IACSF World Cup in Fort Benny, which gave her the ticket for 2012 London Olympics. Thus, she became the first Indian woman to go to Olympics in 25-meter pistol. But unfortunately, she failed to reach the heights there. In 2013 World Cup Changwon, she scripts another first for her nation. First woman to win an INSSF World Cup gold medal in an individual event. 2014 Asian Games saw her winning a bronze in team event with Anisha Said and Hina Sidhu. The same year, she won individual gold in Glasgow Commonwealth Games. Just the time when she was looking to break into the top of her form, she suffered a huge setback in 2015 as she injured her elbow from an accident which took away almost two years from her shooting test. The impact was so huge that she even thought of ending her career. I was in the rehab for 10 years and that is when Manu and Saurav came into the team and that's when I felt my team doesn't need me anymore. I didn't know whether I was going to perform it. After 10 months, when I lifted my pistol, it was checking and I missed my targets every time. So I thought, it's better to play the last competition and retire. But she did not let those feelings to crush her dreams. As her inspiring words tell, I introspected and thought about the time when I started off. I questioned the reason why I took up this sport. I was lucky enough to do what I liked. I decided to give myself another chance. I gave three to four months to myself to see where I stand. I am very excited and I am waiting for a great performance in Tokyo. In 2017, she appointed Munkhabaya Dorhuren, two-time Olympic medalist and her competitor in 2012 as her coach. She came back stronger in 2018 with double individual gold in Youth Commonwealth Games in India and Asian Games Jakarta. Again the first woman to win gold medal in shooting in Asian Games for India, that too with a Games record score of 34. Another gold medal in 2019 ISSF World Cup Munich earned her quota for Tokyo Olympics. 
After COVID-19 pandemic gap, she kept on her sound form in brilliant fashion at her home soil as she clinched an individual silver and a team gold in IASIS Net World Cup, New Delhi 2021. Sadly, the current world number one and reigning world champion in 25 meter Chinky Yadav's Olympic quota was given to another athlete by the Federation in desperation to make the Olympic team fully complete. So, world number seven in 25 meter event and number two in 10 meter air pistol teenage sensation Manu Hakir will be accompanying her in Olympic. We will also be competing in 10 meter air pistol individual and mixed team event. So pressure will be huge on both of them for respective reasons to perform well, mainly on Rahi as she and her huge experience were chosen over world number one Chinki. But Rahi seems very much confident ahead of Olympic. As she says in an interview, we are treating Olympics like other competition. But till the London Games or till Avina got the medal, it was just a dream. The perspective was very different. But it changed after London Olympics. I believe that Tokyo is going to be most successful Olympic Games in Indian shooting because we have started believing in ourselves. We are confident that we are better than everybody else and we are going to perform. We have to believe that we are best. All the crew members of Team Kilovers wish her all the very best for Tokyo Olympics 2021. Our primary focus is to highlight those who deserve spotlight in the field of sport but do not get enough of it. If you want to be part of the initiative, do share the videos as much as possible. Like, comment, subscribe our channel for more videos.